I'm Colleen Johnson, endometrial cancer survivor and marathon runner, and I'm treated at West Cancer Center. I was diagnosed two days after my 57th birthday. What a great birthday present that was. Uh, I went to the doctor mainly to find out why I hadn't hit menopause. I did not go to the doctor to talk about cancer. But when he saw me the first he knew immediately what he was looking at and uh, told me I had something called endometrial cancer. I had the fourth most common cancer found among women in the United States. Extremely common and yet I had never heard of it. It turns out that there is something that endometrial cancer patients, and in fact, a lot of, on, of adult onset cancer patients can do to improve their own chances of living. And that's lose weight if you need to lose weight, eat a healthy diet, and get into a regular and vigorous exercise program. Now. At my peak, I was 242 pounds. I did my first 5K uh, seven months after my radiation treatments were completed. Um, and then 22 days later, I ran my first half marathon. Uh, I did my first full marathon. Now, full marathon is 26.2 miles. I did my first full marathon five months later. I was 61 when I did my first 100-mile uh, race. That was in 2016. A lot of times when I'm running, I'm imagining cancer cells on the sidewalk or the street where I'm running. And every time I lay my foot down, I slam my foot back on the pavement, I'm killing another cancer cell. I guarantee you, I did not see my cancer journey taking me to the finish line of a 100-mile race. Guaranteed, I never saw that coming.